Dolly is the first year media project of Blake Wood, and what we also believe is his first attempt at coding. The game itself is a free to play platformer that takes about 10 minutes to complete. It's brief, but the gently told story, art and environment take you on an emotional and memorable journey. The game begins on a pink screen, and a heart rate monitor beats steadily in the background. You're told that it's painful, but you need to give an answer, that it's the right thing to do, for her sake and yours. It's little detail, but it speaks loudly. The screen fades into this beautiful minimalist setup. You're this tiny black creature perched on a giant head. A red sun hides behind the forest in the background. There's no instruction, no guide to tell you what to do. You just wander off on your lonesome. The red sun watches your first steps from afar. Perhaps you'll find something. Maybe courage, maybe closure. The platforming is simple with echoes of Super Meat Boy that are especially apparent in the wall jumps. Along with the platforms you cross, there are little puzzles to solve. These challenges may invoke a few retries, but never study your momentum. The environment takes a shape akin to the start of a throat, and then transitions into a long vertical stretch like an esophagus. You're going down into the body and to its depths, and surely there you will find an answer. Eventually you'll stumble upon a place up high with giant structures that further humble your size. Climbing up the chain you feel so small. Once you reach the top there are clouds. Is this heaven? You solve the puzzle, and the ground shakes fervently. The screen turns black. It's silent at first, but then the heartbeat returns. It's as steady as before, but slower. Much slower. You return to the start, and the landscape that once looked like a face now resembles a skull. There's nothing to do, but continue onward. The red sun has grown larger. Red is everywhere. It sits on the tips of spikes, spelling danger. The transitions between stages are sudden, like jump cuts or a skip in your heart. Is her heart skipping a beat? Is time running out? You continue onward until you reach the slope of the mountain. As it steepens, you slow. The red descends and consumes the sky. The screen goes black again, and the heartbeat dwindles out. Hopefully that gives you an idea of the game's experience. We personally found it very powerful. We also had a chat with the developer Blake. He told us the game is called Dolly after the famous sheep clone, but that part was cut out. If you play the game, you'll spot an animal with some horn-like features that reference it. He was also kind enough to tell us that the game actually takes place inside the girl's head as she dies. That explains why the visuals get stripped away and why we get the beautiful minimalist setting. We'd also like to give a shout out to one of our viewers, Mikey Loves Indie, who is the one that got us onto Dolly. He actually makes videos too and you might want to check out his playthrough of Dolly. We'll have a link in the description. That's the end of Dolly and the end of us. Thanks for watching, my name's Lawrence. And my name's Josh. We'll see you next time here on Indie Former.